Oh, uh, hi there. My name is Professor Cool, but you can call me PC for short. Here at the Awesome Research Center, or ARC, the world's finest scientists gather to unlock Earth's greatest mysteries. Let's see what they're up to. Follow me. Allow me to introduce Dr. Dude. What's up, bro? Mr. Thinks a lot. That is correct. And Miss Marty. How can I help you? We study everything from apples to alligators, bees to baloney, and cards to cats. However, we have come across something that we cannot understand. We aren't even sure why it exists. What I'm talking about is, of course, bullying. We thought to ourselves, how could something like this be happening right now? What kind of negative effects does it have? And how can we stop it? That is why we created a video showing our research on this tragic topic. Roll the tape! Good evening. I'm here to talk to you about a subject you may already be familiar with. That subject being bullying. Many of you may have already been involved in this and wish you could escape it. Never fear. My friends and I have been working around the clock to figure out exactly what bullying is. But now, I believe we have finally solved the mystery. Step 1. Understanding the Clause some may think that people bully just because they enjoy tormenting others. This may not be entirely true, though. Most bullies originate from families that have experienced divorce or some other dysfunction. Others may have even been abused when they are at home. This means that while bullies seem happy on the outside, they may actually be hurting on the inside. Step 2. Knowing the Effects You probably think that victims of bullying are the only ones who get hurt. That would be wrong. The truth is, when a bully hits others, he is actually hitting himself. You see, most bullies are young and not very smart. So when they pick on others, they don't think about the consequences of their actions. Here are some crazy effects that bullying can dish out. Not sleeping well, feeling sad, and getting stomach and headaches. So do your part. Stop bullying right in his tracks. Step three. I know that after hearing all those terrible things, you must be asking yourself if there is any way to stop bullying. Unfortunately, there is no way to completely eradicate it. However, there are several steps that can be taken in order to greatly reduce or prevent these kinds of things from happening. One thing that can be done is making sure that the parents and teachers know how to recognize the signs of bullying before it's too late. It has also been found that gathering the bully, victim, and parents together helps greatly. Bullies are usually unaware of the damage they cause, so if they are all able to meet each other, then these concerns can be brought to attention. This will surely end the problem. Welcome back. I hope you've learned a thing or two from this cartoon. But all of the knowledge in the world is useless without some action behind it. It's up to you to recognize the signs of bullying and do your best to stop it. Thank you for listening, I'm Professor Cool, and I bid you farewell. Wow, that was really informative. <coughs> Guys? Guys? Oh no, not again.